Wow, you said you wanted a three-car garage. If you do, give me a call at 704-345-3400. I know you get tired of seeing my dirty Toyota. Man, this is Walnut Creek, and this is Eastwood Homes, a great local slash regional builder. Look at all that style right there. Third-car garage, I don't know what you call that, but I like it. So this one's got some great woods in the back. It's priced about 375 ish Prices can always go up or down. It's a four-bedroom, two-and-a-half bath in the 2,500 to 2,600 square foot range, closer to 26. So it's, again, a transom with these three larger windows up, so you've got a place to put furniture. They've got it staged, so call me and ask me what that means. Uh, ask me what that means when they stage a home. That's a quick move spec home. My number's on the screen, 704-345-3400. So they've got that as a dining room. It looks great, got a little area rug in it, showing you the possibilities here. So this Drexel plan is really efficient, sitting on a great lot, and if you need a third car garage or want one, then this could be the perfect house. Gourmet kitchen, meaning you got that double stack, and then a wide uh, cooktop, 36 inch. I love seeing a window over the kitchen sink, there's something about it. So this opens up, it's really grand space, and uh, if you're used to looking at say 3,000 square foot houses like the one I just toured, uh, probably have the link for that at the end of this video, uh, then, you know, this may or may not be the house for you. This one's priced a little higher. It's got a third car garage, got a, a cool wooded lot. Looks like you've got uh, uh, a stream or a drainage running in the back. I love that. And although we've had rain, we haven't had a huge amount of rain this week. You know, you could easily put a cool pergola on this back here. I just had one put up at our house and I've got a guy that I like real well. So call me and ask me about that. 704-345-3400. I know you, you, you're watching this because I caught your eye with the third car garage thing, right? Walk-in pantry. So let's go back and just take a look. And here's a room right here. They've got a couple of chairs in here, but you would put like a drop zone in there or something else to make sense of that space. But check this out. There's a two car garage. And look at this right here. You've got that third bay, easy access to it. And I don't know whether that's a workshop for you, uh, a pottery, uh, a little shop, a YouTube studio, whatever that is, or that's where you park your Porsche. But it's really perfect for the right people. Don't ask me about a third car garage though. We have a third car garage and I park my, do uh, my dog's car and my car outside. Don't ask. <laughs> Oh, wow, this is nice. I love that they staged it. All right, guys, so now we got a half bath. We didn't hit that one, I don't think. We got a powder room on the main level. So you, your guests, they have somewhere uh, to use. And I love the fact that they take advantage of these kind of spaces uh, underneath the stairway. That's a coat closet. Let's go upstairs, guys. So you've got four bedrooms and two baths up. I do love the, the oak treads, don't you? So let's take a look at this. Perfect plan for the right family. Look at this. So you've got a large loft here. We'll go to the master bedroom last. Four bedrooms up and two full baths. Nice, nice. That's a good sized bedroom, actually. Nice sized bedroom. Got your laundry room here. What about Walnut Creek? If you haven't done your research on Walnut Creek, uh, nice amenities. We're, and really the best entrance to come down is right down 521. So that little bump right there with that window up, that's cool. Put some furniture up against there. Here's your second bath up. Double sink. Rectangular undermount sink. Here's yet another bedroom. And maybe you're using this one as an office. It could be obviously whatever you want. Treadmill room, whatever. So guys, you know the seller pays my fee, there's no extra charge to you. If you go into a double door going into the master, if you go into the model home without an agent, you don't save money, don't ask for a discount, well go ahead and ask, and then give me a call. Because again, if you're buying a new home, you don't wanna go it alone. If they have an agent, that on-site agent is the agent for the seller. This is good size, guys. Look how much room is here for furniture. I love that they staged it. So having a buyer's agent, because it might be this house that got your attention, but this may, may not be the house. This might be one of the houses out of 10 that you consider, but this may not be the house. So you got double sink there. So that's why having an experienced buyer's agent, especially one like me or my broker partners, you may end up with me and Jack, you may end up with one of my other folks. They're all excellent, or I, I wouldn't associate with them. Nice size, man, semi-frameless shower, soaker tub, and again, you've got 
a beautiful wooded backyard to look at. How would you like to wake up to that? So give me a call at 704-345-3400. Make sure you uh, like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.